Carolyn, it was a horrifying, horrifying ordeal for a local man when two men who were armed with guns started breaking down his front door. Tonight, the owner telling 7 Action News reporter Jim Kirstner how he managed to fight back. It's just before 2 a.m. The two guys are casing the neighborhood, looking for a target. And then they do this. And all of a sudden I heard, doom, doom, doom. One guy is wearing a bandana. The other guy does not have his face covered. Anthony is waiting for them as they barge in. Keep in mind, they both got guns because it didn't even cross my mind. Hey, you may get shot right now. He shoves them out and one points his gun at the door. Like he's about to shoot through the door. By that time, I bend down, get down close to the ground. His girlfriend was inside. She was hiding in the closet and calling police. The guys take off. Ypsilanti police won't tell us if they've had similar home invasions. They won't say if they've gotten any tips on who these guys might be. They won't say if they've made any arrests. Anthony posted it on Facebook and says he's gotten several tips he's turned over. He could be solving his own crime. And it's amazing the power of Facebook. Police tell us never confront anyone with a gun, but Anthony says he wanted to protect his house and his girlfriend. And he says maybe those young kids, their guns, we're not loaded. In Ypsilanti, Jim Kurtzner, 7 Action News. Scary. All right. Yeah, terrifying. Mm -hmm.